Okay, I have this drink. I remember Nikolai admitted he walked up to Larian, I mean, excuse me, he walked up to Dante and stabbed him. He admitted Dante was the last person he stabbed. Here you can see Nikolai, dark swim trunks, bigger build. On the right, you can see Dante, swim trunks, lighter on top, darker on bottom. You'll see Nikolai walk up to Dante and stab him in the chest. You'll see Dante recoil from the stab. You see the boys on the right running to their tubes. And in the second here, you'll see Alex Bang. You'll zoom in on him as he runs to Isaac. I'm going to show that again. So few things to note, there's, no, there's nothing between Nikolai and Larian. He's not surrounded. His friend Ariel is there at this point. There's nothing to the left and behind Nikolai, except his group in the distance that you can't see on video. He walks away from those directions towards a group of people and stabs Dante in the chest, not standing his ground. He's seeking out Dante. That's retribution, not self-defense. And recall, too, the DNA results. Isaac's DNA and Dante's DNA was the only DNA on the knife. They're also the last two that are stabbed. It makes sense from how the analyst described DNA and how it can wash off. You probably noticed throughout this trial, not a lot of witnesses come off looking great after they testify. There's some exceptions. Obviously, the Good Samaritans who went to aid Isaac and AJ. Eric Von Williams included in that from Nikolai's group. He's the only one who went to their aid. Sheena Lowell, you heard her testify from the Carlson group. You saw her just standing in the background watching what was going on the whole time. She was completely sober. You heard her testify, Nikolai Punch Madison. She has zero connection with the group anymore, zero contact. Her and Quentin broke up. Tony is another one. He only comes in to break up what he thinks is a fist fight. He's directing. Nikolai, towards Nikolai's group, Nikolai turns and stabs him twice. Another one I submit to you is an exception that acted admirably is Isaac. His death was tragic and horrific. This is what you see of Isaac in the video. On the left, he's standing next to his tube, not moving away from his tube. He's pointing at Nikolai to leave. In the middle, when Nikolai turns back to Isaac, Isaac puts his hands up, fingers splayed. The only other thing you see of Isaac is him standing in the background. When the boys, other boys are mocking calling names to Nikolai. Isaac is just standing in the background. He's not saying anything. He's not doing anything. He's not jeering. He's just standing there holding their tubes. There's been a pretty serious mischaracterization of Isaac's actions with regard to when he gets stabbed. 